in the club well that they'll expect a performance and expect to be able to get something from it. Um, they'll see it as an opportunity. Obviously, the start of the season has not been great, so um, but I do think the form has lifted. It looks as if there's an energy in the team, and um, it is going to be difficult though with the the quality of Celtic. I think my from my own experiences, their games after international, there can be a dip with the, the performance levels at club just from the break and the travel. So I think for Hearts, they've got to use that as much as they can. And I think Celtic will just want to slip back into that, that routine they've been in. What's it like, that period where you, you leave a role? Do you still keep an eye on, on how Hearts have, have been ticking along? Do you distance yourself from it? How does it work? No, I, I still keep a keen eye on, on the club and, and there's nothing more than I want is for them to be successful. I feel that in my time there we have progressed the club to from where it was when we took over and the squad I think is a good squad. I think it's one that just needs a bit of time to, to get used to being at a club that size of demand. And um, So yeah, I've, I've watched a lot of their games and, and like I said, I think the team's got more energy. I think some of the, the, the players that have come in in the summer are getting that familiarity with the team and, and the expectation and what's expected and, and it's shown in the performances so yeah the, the last thing that's needed now is just a run of results I think that and I'm, I'm confident that will come for them. We saw Hearts go to Ibrox and go pretty close you know had certainly had chances what does it take to get that, that next step when you, you're trying to topple the big sides? I think it's in their games especially you don't get as many opportunities as you maybe do in other games um, I always said you need to defend very well, but you need to be comfortable having the ball. And I think, as you said there, in the game against Rangers, Hearts were comfortable in possession, which gives you a bit of momentum and lets you try to dictate the game. Um, that will be important. The club, the, the fans will want a, an energetic performance and that will be expected as well. Um, but the one team in the league, I think, that can kill you at any moment is, is Celtic. So it's about defending well, but being brave enough on in possession as well. I think the numbers are pretty good, uh, but I think also the overall game uh, play is is good. I try to create a lot of chances, uh, score goals, and uh, at the moment I feel really good and yeah, just happy. And hopefully we keep going like this. You've spoken before about the dental problems and physical problems you had when you first came. Has is that the main thing that's improved, or is it just taking time for you to really hit top form this season? Yeah, of course. Uh, not easy to come in winter transfer window um, with the dental problems I had. Uh, lost some weight, but uh, I said uh, a couple of times now, full pre-season was important for me, and uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm feeling good. The stuff's helping me. The team is uh, unbelievable, and yeah, we keep going. I believe the German national team manager said you were a player he was keeping an eye on at the moment. How does it feel to hear that? Yeah, really good. Uh, I think that's what we play for, and yeah, the focus is now on Celtic. But uh, of course, that's a goal of mine. Yes, it's a nice byproduct of playing well for your club. You get that recognition. How much of a an aim or a priority is it for you to try and enter that picture? Yeah, I said uh, a couple of years ago already. Uh, the goal is to play in the in the national team. Uh, first goal was Champions League. Uh, I made the dream come true, and uh, yeah. We will see. I suppose scoring against a German team in the Champions League can't have done any harm. Yeah, and not just any German team. It was my former club. It was uh, even better. I enjoyed it a lot. And uh, yeah, after I talked some with some of the guys from there, so it was really nice. How does it feel to be here today, helping out in the local community? Yeah, really good. I think it's uh, really important. Uh, uh, what the people are doing here is is amazing. Uh, it's quite cool, but uh, yeah. Really nice. Is that something that comes with playing at a club like Celtic? You have your job on the field, but a big responsibility to try and help off of it? Yeah, of course. I think you represent a, a big club. Uh, those things uh, are part of it, and uh, yeah, we enjoy.